Hello and welcome back to the next episode of our Stardew Valley Let's Play series. I have some things to put out and I believe we got a new book. Those are our letters. Our achievements are coming along. Yeah, I got so much cooking and stuff to do. I still need more geos. We need more artifacts. A lot more artifacts. I haven't gotten those yet. I knew I hadn't gotten the doll, so that's the crackdown for. I'm still missing one of the dwarf scrolls. I might go down, honestly, into the um, into the mine and see if we can try and get one of those. I still need to sell more stuff. I need to sell a duck feather. I thought I did. Hmm, I don't know. We've got a lot we need to get doing. And I did get a new power. Didn't I? Uh, where are they? Here we are. I got the alleyway buffet. We have a greater chance to find items in the trash can, which sounds interesting considering how I look in the trash all the time. So I am down with that. Let's go ahead and check the weather report. Oh, the Stardew Valley Fair is tomorrow. I've been collecting items, but we need a bit more. I did not save any wine. Uh, that's okay. I think I still have one going. Oh, tappers. I need to make tappers also. And we need to go to Pierre's. Whoa. And get pumpkin seeds. Hi, Zena. That was quite a workout walking all the way up here. I'm sorry. Anyway, I came by to ask if you wanted to have dinner with us tonight. You don't have to, but if you decide to come, could you bring a largemouth bass with you? That's right, one of those big slimy fish from the lake. I need one for the casserole I'm making. Okay, well, it'll be at our house around 7 p.m. tonight. Don't forget the largemouth bass. Um, I normally like to wait until Kent comes back. Uh, one of these days you should come by my room after dark, maybe around 8 p.m., I want to show you something. That's from Abigail. I just want to remind you about the Stardew Valley Fair. Mayor Lewis. Okay, not a problem. So, uh, I don't know. I have mixed feelings about that because I normally like to wait until he comes back. That way we can have dinner with the whole entire family. Looks like our amaranth is done. So, I'll go ahead and grab that. Give me the mushrooms. I think I have more mushrooms to put in there. Why is there some hay up here? I don't know. Let's get rid of that. Thank you. I don't want you there. You know what? I might move those kilns into the shed for right now. We do have the keg started. I need more kegs, but for that, I need more wine. Well, no, don't do that. I wanted to look in here. A pickled amaranth. That might be okay to put in the, um, jeez, I don't know why. I do know why. It's fine. Um, it might be okay to put into the Stardew Valley Fair. So far, I have the fairy rose honey and the mutant carp. I can put in one pepper popper. I could do that. That's a good one. Because that'll give us a crafted one. Although I think I might have... Do I have a... Oh, whatchamacallit. Whoa, things are missing here. There they are. Our watering can. I might have a chocolate cake left over. That I haven't gifted out. Do we have that anywhere? I do have Autumn's Bounty and I have a fried calamari. I think maybe the Autumn's Bounty might do better. We'll pop that in there too. And speaking of, let's go ahead and nom that for a little speed boost. Just to get us moving around the farm oh, that much faster. Do I have eggplant anywhere? No, not really. Oh, maybe they're in the other box over here. Yes, they are. Apparently, I'm saving those. Okay. I don't know. I have stuff everywhere. Uh, let's go ahead and collect our apples because they need to be done. I think the pomegranate is going to be done. 
by the end of the month, yeah? And we are going to stick you, I guess. Can we put you over here? Yeah, there we go. He looks kind of weird and creepy down there, I agree. <laughs> Let's get the girls milk. Thank you for your milk, little goat. And you need to give me some. Thank you. And a good morning, Jeffrey. How are you today? Are you adjusting well? Um, I think I'm saving the non-starred milk to get processed. And I'm just putting my cheese in there. We're going to turn all that into pepper poppers eventually. Check on the girls up here. Hopefully they are happier today. Oh, we got a duck egg. I've already donated it to Gunther, so it doesn't matter. We don't need to uh, take it back over there. Good morning, everyone. There's the duck feather I need to sell. Is that everybody? Yeah, I think so. And I think that was all the eggs, maybe? Yeah, that was all the eggs. All right, let's get a dinosaur mayo. I was going to say, am I missing one? I'm going to hold on to that one. I think that'll be more than enough mayo tomorrow to sell for some good profit. There we go. I got to get this situation taken care of. We definitely need... Oh, wait. I want to put the void egg in. We definitely need more um, sheds. <laughs> I need one more shed. No, don't put it in there. We are going to put it in at the incubator over there. And in a couple weeks, days, months, whatever, it'll be... Avoid chicken, which will be cool. I need to go... Oh, greenhouse. We have the greenhouse now, too. We need to go in and do things in there. I want to put in coffee beans. I have 49. I want 10. All right. We've got things for in the greenhouse. Let's go put the bee house down over here. I'm thinking I might move the bee houses over to closer to the farm. I'm not liking them this far away. Don't think we have any honey. No, we don't. I, I don't like them that far over here. Um, they just feel way too far away. Now for in here, I am going to start, I guess, over here. If we do three, four, and five, right? There we go. I think that'll work. We've got coffee beans over here, strawberries up here. These are hot peppers, and these are the start of our ancient seed. Uh, yeah, I've got the uh, sprinklers laid out, so they're going to water everything, and then we have room for three more iridium sprinklers as we get them. I need to water the flowers over here, then we're going to head off two pierres and get those pumpkins looks like a couple of my spots filled in so i'll need to get those taken care of i think i want to buy a little bit more amaranth too i like growing it it does pretty good in the preserves jars and it does pretty good if you turn it into a juice i yeah i don't want to put any of that out it's not gonna not gonna be beneficial to us they're the wrong season oh i got some clay that's exciting <laughs> I tell you what, this uh, 1.6 update really hampered people on the clay front, but it's fine. We'll get through it as one does, right? Those can all go in there. I just want to start working on getting more, more strawberries that we can plant next season. Where am I going to keep eggs? I guess they can go in here for right now. Those can go in there. Uh, I don't know if I need to... Wait, do I have bok choy in this other one? I might... I do. Yeah, there we go. We need to sell the duck feather. I was going to save it for Elliot, but it's all good. Uh, what else do I need here? There was something I needed to go and do and buy. I need a heater before the end of the season. Maybe... I don't think Marnie's there today, but I can uh, run down and check. I did not put anything in the dehydrator, did I? Oh, yes, I did. Those are the seed makers. Uh, eventually, I will get those trees chopped down and put them into the greenhouse. I do have an extra pomegranate I could put in there, but for right now, I'm just going to hold off. We will wait a little bit longer on that, and my watering can needs to go down there. I was just kind of cheating and putting it up top. It was easier than switching bars every two seconds. Yeah, I didn't think Marnie was going to be here. I had a feeling she was going to town to do her shopping. Eventually, I want to get the book that lets me um, 
do you think that her place uh well that wasn't what i had in mind when it came to getting things out of the trash but okay game hey penny it's kind of embarrassing to be the only family in town who lives in a trailer well maybe one day i will take care of that you are very welcome marnie would you like one i know you don't care for it but baby steps and she's on her way home but i don't think she actually goes to her shop you want to talk to me you feel responsible for everybody's health well as the only doctor in town i can understand that i should probably go check crobus's inventory uh probably don't really need it though until wednesday right yeah tomorrow's the fair no birthdays until after the fair good morning ladies you found some mild mushrooms over the weekend i have been finding all kinds of wild mushrooms myself 13 days that's going to get them done just on the last day, I believe. I think. Maybe I should put some speed grow down for those. I could. Let's get 30 of them. Yeah, and I can put some of them in the greenhouse if I need to, just until we start getting more ancient seed. What else do we need in here? Nothing. I think we're good. Thanks, Pierre. Uh, he's probably selling my produce at an exorbitant price, isn't he? Uh, glasses. This is so not what I was expecting when they said more trash. And it's like, I want, I want a cooked meal. Dang it. I want a cooked meal. All right, what do we get this week? Um, you're about goop, known as ectoplasm. And you're looking for bug guts. Ooh, those are both good ones. Uh, a ghost. So let's accept that one and then we can do Willie's the next time just because I kind of like doing Rasmodius's. Let me run back home and then I guess I'll run up to the mines and see what I can get into. Hey Carolyn, you going down to talk to with Jody? Oh, we've got some sap going. Yay, I will take that sap. Thank you. Can I? I think one of the seeds I planted didn't take. Uh, not that one. Can we plant you up here, maybe? No, you can't plant it up here. That's a pity. I would have done so. I want to get more trees growing around the valley so I can chop them down for her. our wood needs. Our wood needs are great. <laughs> they are very great at the moment. That'll do for now. I think the tree seeds go in here. Yeah, they do. Uh, saps in there? No, where do... Oh, I don't have any. Well, let's make another keg. Yeah, I definitely... Wait a minute. I need more tappers. Can I make some? I can make tea. What am I short on? I'm short on wood. I, I knew that was going to be a, a limiting factor. Wait a minute. Where did I want to go? To the mines. That's where I wanted to go. Uh, yeah, I can pop the keg down here in a minute. Let's go put these tree tappers on. And I'll drop off this trash. I think this is these. Maybe. Actually, yeah, we'll, we'll do those too. I think those might be the oak. This thing gives a lot of them, doesn't it? Uh, no, no, no. Let's go over there. Oh, six more coal. Thank you. Is that just giving me deluxe bait? I will take that deluxe bait. Thank you. I don't think I need anything else. Maybe I should make a couple more regular worm bins. I don't know. I don't know. I'll think about it. All right, let's go ahead and drop this keg off in here and get it doing its little keggy goodness stuff. Uh probably not going to have any in time for the fair. I am going to run up to the Adventurers Guild since we're going that way. They are not in there. They're over here. Yeah. Yeah. Let's pop those in there too. And I should probably catch that largemouth bass. I don't think I have an extra one. I do, but I don't know that I Oh, whoa cranberry wine yeah all right there we go for the fair tomorrow that popped out just in the nick of time i will take it and let's go ahead and put you in here 
and we can get you doing whatever it is you need to do. Come on. There you go. Thank you very much. I'm going to have to make sure I bring more stuff in there. What are you doing all the way up here? There's no food there for you. I'm going to move that down there. I don't want to be looking at bait. <laughs> it seems a little weird. So, in the mail, I ran down to go check the mail a little bit ago, and my cookbook for Stardew Valley came in, so I am very excited. So, expect to see recipes come into the channel from that cookbook uh, probably next week, which you will actually see the cookbook or the cooked items from the cookbook before this episode airs, I believe. Because I am recording ahead. I am getting ready to go out on vacation at the beginning of June. The whole first week of June. I will be on vacation. So I am recording some extra Stardew Valley to post while I'm gone. Just because I love this game so much. And it's the game I really feel like recording right now. Uh, yeah, I know. Another book for the library. It's fine. I decided to come up here and check if there were any more trees. And there are. Let me go ahead and scoop these two up. Because wood and our needs, right? They are great. <laughs> they are great. We need so many. I wish I could, like, chop down all those trees at the bottom there. That would be sweet. And what are you bleeping about? Yeah, that. I would like to do willies. Even though I can't keep any of that bug meat. But I could probably collect some extra for us. So I have bait, too. Oh, you know, I haven't seen Linus in a while. I should probably say hello to him. Hey, Linus. You've explored deep into the caves. They hold some hidden secrets. That they do. Would you like a hazelnut? That's a good find. I'm always happy when eating wild food. Thank you. You are very welcome. He is up to seven hearts. I will take that. Oh, yeah. New week. New gifts available to people, right? Where are you going, Demetrius? Come back. During this time of the year, I divert my attention to fungi. Well, here, how about some fish? You're welcome. I saw Robin down there, but Robin can just do Robin's thing. <laughs> I don't feel like walking back down there to her. Let's grab that. Oh, we're up to 124, so maybe I can make a few more tree tappers, though. I'm probably getting short on copper because I really haven't been going down to the copper levels much to get more. I think the dwarf scroll I need is from the later floors, I'm going to say. Thank you very much. How are we doing? We're up to almost halfway done with the void sprites. Slimes are still going. Oh, I'm almost done with the bats also. I need, I'm halfway done with the duggies. Rock crabs are almost halfway done. So... We're getting there slowly but surely. I will be back soon, Gil. I will be here soon to collect things. Ooh, I can chop these trees down, though. Alright, let's go ahead head into the mine. Let me drop some of this stuff off in the box. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have so much stuff everywhere in the valley, don't I? I don't think I need any of that right now. I need ghosts, so let's go down... I think they start around, what, 65? Maybe. Is there another? Oh, there he is. Can you give me the thing I need right away? I would be very appreciative. Because it can take a while to get this stuff. Come on. Thank you. And I won't say no to any call that you guys want to drop. Thank you. Nope. Oh, you jerk. Get over here. Come on, just drop it for me. No, you gave me a solar essence. Alright, well, I'm going to go grind for this... Pris or prismatic jelly in it? No, not prismatic jelly. It's the ectoplasm that we need. Oh, got another monster compendium book. We can uh, sell that to the trader. I don't think reading it gives us any more defense. It would be sweet if it did, if you could stack a couple of those books, say, I don't know, two or three. What is that? Is that a bat sitting on top of iron? Yeah, oh, yeah, it was. It just made it look really weird. Come here, bat. You need to go. Thank you. Oh, you need to hurry up, little ghost. This is only the third ghost I've seen. They are very few and far between. I tell you, this is one of the 
Well, no, I'm sorry. The um, the other one, yeah, I didn't get it. But we do need to go home. It is 12 o'clock. So I will have to work on it another day. Uh, we're not going to get it today, unfortunately. It's okay, though. Oh, I guess I can just take all that home, right? I'm going to leave those up here for right now. Oh, good night. It is 1220. Let's get to the bus stop. I just wanted to get that last one. I was kind of hoping I wasn't paying attention to the time, to be honest with you. If you really want to know. <laughs> Oh, man. I know. I was sort of talking about the cookbook. It is beautiful. They've done an amazing job on it. I can't wait to really sit down and dive into it. I didn't have a lot of time to uh, to look into it. Because, like I said, I really have a lot of recording to do if I want to be able to safely go on vacation and have enough content for everybody to watch. Uh, anything else I need to put away? Yeah, we need to put the rocks away, the wood away. Moss can go. I think I'm keeping sap over here too. Yes, I am. Wow, we have a, quite a bit of sap. And then these need to go away. I think, wait, nope, put these away too. Thank you. I don't know why I didn't just do that in the first place. Let's get the girls closed up and then we need to quickly, quickly dive in bed. I do not think that I got a level up in anything. Oh no, maybe I did. I think I did get a level up maybe maybe or was that the last episode i don't remember it was the last episode that's fine i made it in bed to time or on time that's all that i care about but yeah the cookbook is beautiful if you are into cooking or just into collecting things from stardew i highly recommend picking it up at some point or another it's a great little cookbook they've done an amazing job the pictures in it are stunning and the recipes sound amazing. Alright, well, let's go ahead and uh, check the weather. It is going to be cloudy with gusts of wind. And the fortune teller, mildly perturbed. Luck is not going to be on my side. So it may be harder for me to go ahead and get everything I need for the, uh, um, the tickets I need, right? Oh, I leveled up in farming. That'll put us at level 10 farming. Oh, that'll be good. So we won't have to worry about farming anymore. And then we can start hopefully working on mastery in that eventually. I think you have to get it all 10. Yeah, you've got to get 10 in all of your skills to be able to work on your mastery stuff. That's how that goes. We still only have one lava eel. So I can't donate that one to the community center yet. But baby steps. We are yep, getting there. Thank you. Don't believe I need to go and water anything in the barn. Can we have a pepper popper, please? I want to move just a little bit faster. I'm carrying them around, but I'm not using them very much. I need to remember to do so. Don't really have all that much to do on the farm right now. Uh, it's pretty much just kind of maintenance, right? Let's go water the girls and... Every, not water them, milk them. Uh, I'll pop that in there for right now. Give me your goat cheese. Thank you. I need to put that book away. Yeah, I think I milked you yesterday. I knew that because I picked out a goat cheese. You think I would remember? I kind of wish the goat would give me a uh, a baby goat. <laughs> I am ready for a baby goat. All right, out you go, ladies. Come on, everybody out. Come play check on the girls up here hi guys well, how you doing morning 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 eggs for collection thank you no duck eggs that's fine little genie's doing great over there oh let's get all of our manis we ought to get a good return for this one today everybody out oh you want to go in no don't go in because you'll never get back out again you will be stuck let's get something going in the Hydrator. Let's sell one of the artichokes. I don't know if I've sold those mushrooms yet, and I don't know if I need to sell that. And I've sold those, so I think we're good. Morning, chicken. Uh, thank, thank you for the algae. I appreciate it. <laughs> it's so weird. It just peeps out a little bit of algae. Oh, I didn't notice the corn there. We'll grab it. Put all that stuff away. I have stuff so spread out everywhere and we have no room for any of that do we do apples hey apples will go in 
you know, if that'll boost the tree production value, I'm kind of cool with that. Uh, let's see, what do we have here? We need a gold pumpkin. I think that would be good as a, a vegetable. That'll make a good vegetable. What all do we need here? I have the fairy rose. We have the mutant carp to cover, cover fishing. We have the diamond. We have the pickled amaranth and the wine. I don't think we're going to put that in. I think we'll put Autumn's Bounty in for the cooking. That's seven items. So we need a couple more. What about a fairy rose itself? That ought to be one, right? That's eight. We need one more item. Oh. Oh, I know. I know. Prismatic shard. Yes. That ought to be it. That should give us a good return for the fair. I'm thinking. I'm kind of pleased about that. I think that's probably about the best we're going to do. Uh, those. I need to get those to do something else. How are we doing in here? Everything's good. Good, good. Just waiting on more sap to be able to collect that I don't like those trees being back up there I can't tell what those are so those are actually the maple aren't they what I need are the other ones let's get oh man they take two let's get four how many copper bars do I oh I have 34 copper bars never mind <laughs> the fairs begun it's fine we're gonna actually run over and put these tappers on over here and if I have an extra one I'll stick it in the in the box that I have up here for them yeah here we go let's get these on oh no you gotta actually stand in front of it there you go I can't at least get back to that one's not ready to be tapped I don't think I can't tap that one. Yeah, so what's the point in that tree? I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Uh, what do we have in here? Anything decent? Uh, you know what? If you're only going to give me deluxe bait, come with me. I'm going to stick you down over here where I can make better use of you. Let's put it over here by this chest, I think. And it can just collect in there for right now. Uh, let's put everything away I don't need, and then let's get out of here. Alright, let's go. We got our items, and we are ready to go and attend the fair. This is going to be fun. I do like the Stardew Valley Fair. I have a lot of fun at it. I uh, wonder who our closest friend is in the valley. I'm not sure. I haven't looked at our chart in a while. Uh, you got anything new? Can I look and see what you got? So I'd like to get the dried sunflowers. We definitely want that rare crow and we want, ooh, a thousand for a prize ticket. 500 for a one piece of hay. Oh no, hay times a hundred. Okay. And they only have one, one of each. Okay. Well, it looks like we need... It looks like we need a lot of tokens. Well, Xena, it's a big day. Our most important festival of the year, the Stardew Valley Fair. If you'd like to participate by setting up a Grange display, I've left an empty stand for you. Just let me know after you set everything up so we can get to judging. I will do so. Um, smash the stone? Sure. Oh, I th think if you do, um, yeah... Yeah, a sheepdog. You gotta time it just right. A bodybuilder. Hey, we're getting there. I think if you can get it to where it's just at the very bottom, he gives you a, t a thing just for doing it. A lumberjack. Well, you know, I'm working out. <laughs> Pierre is very serious about his Grange display. He's been setting aside the best looking produce for weeks in preparation. Oh, I'm sure he's been setting aside my my produce. Hey, best of luck to you if you enter. Oh, I will. 
My store carries the very finest quality products in the whole valley. Please inspect my Grange display closely and see for yourself. Oh, yeah. I I'm sure those are my blueberries that you saved, Pierre. I know you. You tried your best, but your display is pretty weak compared to Pierre's. Well, Pierre cheats. I'm just saying. Pierre cheats. <laughs> it doesn't really matter how you put them in. It's more the aesthetic of the way you like them, I think. Uh... Yeah, we'll do it like that. We'll put the Otis bounty there and the wine at the top. Yeah, that looks good to me. I like how it looks. I think it looks better than Pierre's. Poor Willie over here with the fish. Are you setting up a Grange display, Zena? It's your chance to show off all the good produce from Forever Farm. I am definitely going to do that. It's good to talk to everybody over here. Hey, Shane, how you doing? All these animals are friendly and love to get massaged. Okay. Hey, Vincent. Moo. <laughs> Thank you, Vincent. Hey, Harvey. And just a few steps over there, Gus is grilling up a bunch of pork ribs. Yikes. Ooh. Pork ribs, my favorite. Oh, I handpacked my little finger. Oh, no. But you live on a farm or a, a ranch. Jazz. You should be used to the chickens. Are you having a good time? I am having a great time kind of hectic today. I'm just going to hang out here for a little while. Okay. Let's go skip down here. I guess we could get our fortune read. It is a hundred, but sure. Tell me my fortune. Hmm. I see you laying on a cot. It looks like a hospital. Pam is there to keep you company while you recover. What a nice friend. Now I see you and Shane in a field of grass. You seem happy. Whoa. That, no. No. <laughs> we are not happy. We, well, unless we're looking at blue chickens, then that would be different. The crystal ball has moved on. Now I see you harvesting a plump, ripe melon. You're on a wonderful-looking farm, bursting with life. Ah, the crystal ball has gone dim. That's all I can do for you, young one. He's changed that up. Now just keep in mind that the future isn't set in stone. Whatever I've told you today can still be changed if you set your heart on it. Farewell. He's changed that up. It used to be there would be... He saw you in a dangerous um, situation or something like that. Wallach and I have known each other for a long time. She is a remarkable diviner and a good friend. Oh, she. I'm so sorry, Wallach. I did not mean to uh, call you a he. I apologize. I complain about my job sometimes, but I do take pride in my work. There are some. These are some of my fam fam ah, finest pieces. I hope you like them. They're gorgeous. Um, I do quite look, I like looking at swords. I really admire Robin's carpentry skills. I use a lot of the same techniques in my own line of work. I'm surprised you two don't hang out more. Woodworking is an ancient tradition that I'm very proud to be a part of. I can see that. Clint's blades get sharper every year. Well, I wish he would make me a, a, a sword. Robin really works hard on her carpentry stuff. She deserves a little recognition now and then. She certainly does. You know, I would have made a pretty good clown, I think. I missed my calling. You probably would. You've got that friendly kind of personality. He doesn't look very happy. I guess Mary Lewis had to cut costs on a budget clown this year. I would not be surprised. Doesn't look like there's anything over there. So let's head up here. Up oh, there's Penny. We can say hello to her. I won the Wheel of Chance ten times in a row, and now the man won't let me play anymore. Oh, I hope they didn't change that. I played the strength game too many times and now my arms feel like rubber. Have you been to the fortune teller? She set up her stand in the graveyard. I have. Hey, Pam. Better hurry up, kid, before old Pam fishes every last lunker out of the tent. <laughs> okay, Pam. And then if we head up to the top here. All the way. And the first time I played this, I totally missed this area up here. I wondered why Evelyn and George weren't at the... Um, at the fair, smoked turkey haunch. I guess the festival isn't all bad. And here they were all hanging up up here. Eat as much as you like. It's all free today. Compliments of Mary Lewis. And we can nom a survival burger, which sounds absolutely delicious right now. I'm trying to get Gus to tell me his sauce recipe, but he won't budge. I wish he would tell me the secrets too. This barbecue sauce is amazing and we can uh, nom one more for good measure, right? For good luck in the fair. Uh, we're going to probably need it. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know what? Yeah, let's go ahead and have our Grange display. Yes. And then we'll do the mini game. 
I, I like to do the fishing mini game, to be honest with you. And then I do the, the Wheel of Fortune one after I have a fair amount of tickets. I won't make you watch all that, but we will hopefully walk out of here with about 4,000 tickets, I think is what we need roughly to get everything. Come on, Pierre. Walk a little faster, buddy. I called him Pierre, didn't I? I was just sitting here thinking, that's Mayor Lewis. <laughs> I don't know what I've been drinking today, or maybe somebody put something in my Dr. Pepper, but... All right, your Grange display has been judged. Return to Mayor Lewis for the results. I am so sorry I called you. Whoa. Apparently, we won with 105 stars. Thank you. And we got a new achievement. Your prize is 1,000 stars. Your or star tokens. Spend them wisely. Oh, and don't forget to clean out your Grange display box. Yes, I will go do that right now because I have forgot it in the past. It doesn't matter. It goes into lost and found. But it used to be that you would lose everything that was in here. And I do not want to lose our Prismatic Shard. It is the only one we have gotten. And I want the Galaxy Sword just as soon as we get to the desert. That'll be the first thing I do. Yes, let's play for 50 gold. <whistles> this one's pretty easy. You just fish up as many fish as you can fish in a minute and a half. Something like that. Two minutes. And then it multiplies them all. I, I like this one. It's pretty simple and easy. Um, the fishing mini game, or skipping the fishing mini game makes it even faster, which I approve of. Oh, let's see how we did. 331. We caught nine fish. And 500. So a score of 842. We got a thousand stars. You know what? Ice. That put me up to 2008 already. Let's go ahead and do it this way. It's better than playing the other mini game, right? Let's get in there and do some more fishing then. Yeah, I like this better. <laughs> I don't have to sit there and bet on orange and green over and over again and lose some every once in a while. Make it longer to get all the ones I need. There we go. I went fishing two more times and I've gotten more than enough, I think. If I need a little bit more, maybe I'll do it one more time, but I should be able to buy everything. So let's start off with the star drop. That'll get us more energy. Yay. Always a good thing. We're still waiting on our rare seeds to grow so we can get the one from the uh, secret forest. There we go, and then we want to spend more. We want to get the, the rare crow. We want the prize ticket. That leaves me 900. Uh, yeah, I do need a little bit more, don't I? Uh, let's go with the hay. We'll buy 100 hay. Why not? I definitely want those. So another thousand. We'll just buy them out this year. Yeah, I will do one more. Maybe one more round of this should get me enough for this, I believe. If I can get another thousand points, that'll do that'll do me. Yeah, that more than did it. We are we've got way so many star tickets. <laughs> way too many now, but it's fine. It's fine. We'll get everything and they can just keep the other ones for another person, right? We'll donate them to somebody else. Let's go ahead and grab the fedora and the light green rug. And that is us done here at the fair. Kind of sad. I have a lot of fun doing this one. It's my favorite. Second favorite. I think I like the moonlight jellies too. They're a lot of fun. Alright ladies, you need to go to bed for the day. Let's go ahead and bob in. Close your door. I am going to tuck the extra hay in their barn just in case tomorrow we can go and spend our ticket uh, can you put rugs down in barns oh you can uh sure let's put the rug down in the barn i like it i've never done that before i could also put it inside the shed if i wanted to but oh wait did i not plant anything there i thought i did do we have any do i have any wheat left over i do let's a little bit of wheat down. What did I pick today? 
I have no clue. Uh, it's hard to tell what I did. I do not remember from this morning. Is that not bad? It, it's pretty bad, right? <laughs> uh, rare crow, where would you like to go? I guess we can pop you down down there. I could probably move you a, down to the other end. We don't need you right there. Right there? Yeah, that looks good. How you doing? You're still at one little fish. Alright, well I think that is going to be everything. Let's go ahead and pop in. A chicken is in bed so I can't give her another hat. Probably put that on the on the the cow, or not the cow. The um Actually, wait, can I put these on scarecrows? Because that would be really cute if I could. I don't know if I can put it on any of these. Yeah, he's already got one. He does too. Can you? No, you can't. Uh, you can't put him on there. I thought you could. Maybe I'm thinking of something different. It's okay. It doesn't matter. Oh, and yeah, I've got a bunch of stuff to put away. But we will be doing that in uh, the next episode. Let's go ahead and pop in bed to see what we sold, what happened, what's going on. Oh, that sounds like a tree. Uh-oh. Oh, I think we have the, there was a strong windstorm during the night. And we went to level 10. Let's go with Artesian. So we will need to check that out, but that is not going to be until the next episode. Also, exciting times once again here in the valley, as always. But that is going to be it for me for the day. So thank you all so very much for joining me. I've been Valkyrie. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I hope I'll see you in the next one.